hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in today and i hope you find this video helpful so today i'm going to be doing a review of rosa chelsea dolce and gabbana's new scent this scent was released last month just before valentine's day but it's a spring scent and it's sold as such um i personally got the scent just a few days ago and honestly I think about a week look at how much I've already used of the scent I absolutely love this scent we'll start with the bottle so the bottle is f this frosted beautiful frosted glass which is so classy and the black tie on it it also has um, the ca the the top of it the cover of it is meant to um, capture basically a bold rose it's red, it's bold, and it's like a, a, a bold red rose color. And that's just the rest of the bottle. I, I think this is such a beautiful, like when it's done, I will definitely like re display it on my vanity. I don't display my perfumes because it messes with the chemistry of perfumes. If you expose it to like a lot of heat, sunlight, and since my bedroom, like light comes right directly into my bedroom because my dressing table faces the sun i kind of like do not display any of my scents but um yeah anyway so i love 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 this scent this is i have i'm wearing it on now it's an order perfume and it's 75 mil i think the biggest bottle you can get in it is 75 mil it retails right now for 77 pounds or 76 pounds if you're getting it from Boots. I got mine from um, a perfume shop in town anyway. And um, I just, I, I smelled it first just when it was out, like in February. And I knew it was the scent that I'm definitely going, I keep smelling it because it's just so beautiful it's mixed um two uh, two types of roses were mixed to create this scent and for the first time ever in perfumery african dog rose was um a rare african dog rose from a tree that grows in south africa was used in perfumery to create this beautiful beautiful scent it's Rosa, it reads as Rosa Excelsior, but it's pronounced as Rosa Chelsea and um, Rosa Chelsea. And I absolutely, I'm kind of like trying to like, what can I say about you? I really love it. It's brilliant. It's a spring scent, like I already sent, said. I've used so much of it because I really um, love it. It's Longet Vire is like um, medium. It's definitely like it will last you six six ish hours. It will last you a good six hours. So it's okay. It's de it's like a sweet but ma yet musky floral scent, and it's very very feminine. Feminine. I really really think it's like I don't know. I didn't think it's possible in perfume to capture delicacy, but yet like a boldness in a fragrance and i think this does that beautifully it's a great spring scent i just think that like it's and it's one of those scents that can be used as a formal scent as well you can wear this to work it's just one of those scents that are really really it's definitely a daytime um daytime fra fragrance i have a lot of perfumes so i would never dream of using this in, at night because I have better night scents basically but it's definitely a beautiful spring scent I love it I usually don't live like rose um, scents like it's not really like a rose really isn't me in perfumes but this is mixed in a way that like you don't really it's not like strongly rose but like it's just it's so good it's brilliant i would advise that before you go purchase it you read the review of it on the dolce and gabbana site it's done beautifully i could not explain it better than they do so definitely go to the dolce and gabbana uh, website and read what like 
the whole makeup of it and everything it's really but i'll give you some notes that are in this neroli leaves which gives it the sweet scent whenever you like spray it on this and then papaya flowers white water li lily and white daffodil turkish rose absolute and rare african dog rose musk cashmere and sandalwood these are like the 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 notes in the in that it the scent is meant to capture the boldness and the purity of a rose in bloom i just i couldn't say enough great things about this definitely head to store head in store and have a sniff of it it's so beautiful the bottle is really beautiful i love red on as the color for the because the rose is red i love the bottle i just i keep repeating myself but honestly i'm like i love it i love it i love it because i love it so much it's calm and gentle yet bold and present it's feminine it's sexy it's everything it's like not overly sexual and sexy but sexy in the in a feminine like a female way i love it i really really love it this is easily gonna be like i'm sure i will repurchase another one because i know i will run through again i've been wearing nothing else but this since i got it so definitely check that out i um was lucky enough if you are in belfast or if you know of any the perfume shop i didn't buy mine from boots because i heard that the perfume shop are doing this thing where when you get that scent you also get a free lipstick by dolce and gabbana desire the one i'm wearing and it comes in that um it's like obviously the tiny version i've repur i've purchased the big uh the actual size of this because of desire because when i tried it on i was like yes this is just beautiful it's what i have on right now it's the red that i have on right now and it's what it looks like so it's dolce and cabana and it's called desire and you get that for free which is a good like that's a good am amount of um lipstick right you get that free and you also get a roll um a rollable perfume of the original dolce which i absolutely love and i have the picture in my background can you see the poster the long poster on this side it's dolce's original fragrance and you get that which is um i didn't show you guys the box of this of the roller you get the roller both sides of it so that's just what you get and it's just a, a roller ball of it but you get that for free and you get the lipstick for free and um oops itchy i will also show you the box the rosa chelsea box it's i i love the packaging as well i think and this will be in my handbag obviously like i'll travel with it in my handbag because it's just really tiny and i'm not throwing the box away because i'm weird like that but so the box of um you can see the lipstick it's gone on it the box is like a slightly deeper pink to the original than the original box like a slightly the original box is like a peach color this is like a light pink color and it's um just that very very classic i love it very very classic and beautiful i love it again this is just in time for the spring and i definitely recommend getting this as this year's spring scent i love it i wouldn't like I'm not one of those people to go in with the hype and say, oh, yeah, yeah, get it, get it, because everyone is wearing it for spring. But I definitely, definitely recommend getting this. And guys, another thing is that I have such a huge perfume collection. If I actually, um, like, if I actually go out and get a scent, there's something special these days. This ha there has to be something special about that scent. So, yeah, that's Tochi. Do, Dolce Rosa Chelsea and yeah Rosa Chelsea 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 anyway thank you guys for tuning in I hope you found this um this um 
video f helpful if you haven't um, smelled it before definitely go smell it and if you have smelled it or you have it can you leave me a comment down in the box below and tell me what you think about the scent and I'll see you guys in my next video thank you guys for tuning in so